Hi everyone, Amy Love here, and I am here today to share my project for the From the Heart of a Crafter collaboration. I'm very excited to be a part of this collab with such amazing, talented people. This is actually the first collaboration that I have hosted myself, and I have just had a wonderful response, and I just want to thank everybody for, for participating. It just means so much to me. And I have a link to all of the amazing channels that are participating below. Please take time to go check them out and show, show them some love. Um, we're all doing different loved theme projects, and I'm sure there's going to be just a bunch of great, great videos. I can't wait to see them all. So, yes, there is a link to everybody's channel below. And some of us are, giving, uh, are doing giveaways. Some of us aren't. You just have to uh, check out the video to see who's, who's doing a giveaway. Um, I am doing a giveaway, and I will tell you more about that later after I show you what I've created. And I know some of you are surprised that it's actually not a heart. I know. <laughs> but I decided to make a loved, a lovebird pincushion. I don't know. I was feeling it, but I'm so glad that I made it. It's so, so shabby and beautiful. I actually started with a paper mache box, and then I added the... Uh, stuffing and fabric to make the pin cushion and then put a doily over the top and then I made uh, little bundles of, of uh, trims and fibers and fabrics and then I just glued them all around glued so many I mean there's just so much here and then I added these beautiful uh, beaded appliques I've got four of them on here and I actually got these from Neri thank you very much Neri they're beautiful and they look fantastic on this nest it was like a perfect perfect touch and then I added these sweet little love birds looking at each other and they kind of do make a heart shape so I guess there's my heart <laughs> and I got these sparkly little love birds at Hobby Lobby they're just so cute so this ended up being um, pretty big I actually uh, was thinking it would be much smaller but that's usually how my projects turn out <laughs> much bigger than I anticipated originally and so I haven't decided yet if I'm gonna be um, selling this or keeping it for myself because I just think it's it's beautiful right I love love how shabby it is but I am gonna have a little giveaway for everybody who leaves a comment below that is 18 years or older and is a subscriber to my channel if you will leave a comment below that includes the words enter me, then you will be um, included in the drawing. And the drawing is going to be for a bag full of goodies and crafty bits that I will include laces and, you know, Amy Love type of things. So you have to put enter me in your comment. That way when I um, do the random draw, I'm going to put in the keywords enter me. So we'll only draw from people who have left that phrase in the comments. So be sure you do that. And of course, it's open to my international subscribers also. I'm thankful for each and every one of you. And I want to thank you all for taking the time to come over and to check out what I've created. And let me know what you think about this shabby, shabby nest. <laughs> it was really fun to make. It really was fun. I didn't do a process video because I showed you how I make these little clusters of fabric and fibers before and that's all I did and I literally just glued it on and then it just no matter what you glue these shabby bits onto it makes it look amazing <laughs> so be sure and check out the rest of the participants I know there's a lot of us but I'm sure you're gonna see some great wonderful things and thank you again to all the ladies who agreed to participate you just you know made me so happy. I'm feeling the love. Thank you so very much. And I will see you all on the next one. Oh, and I will be doing the drawing a week from today. All right. Thanks, everybody.